welcome back to my channel guys thank you so much for subscribing if you haven't subscribed what are you waiting for stay tuned okay guys so i have my cornmeal here so this is two cups of refined cornmeal i'm gonna add my milk i'm using whole milk This is one cup of all milk. And I have my coconut milk and this is half can of coconut milk. Grace coconut milk. You can use whatever coconut milk you like. I'm just going to go ahead and just whisk that around. You can use a spoon as well. So here I have some boiling water. I'm gonna add my cinnamon in. I'm gonna use the cinnamon stick because I love to use that. But you can use a cinnamon powder, but you can use like half teaspoon. So I'm gonna add my stick in. So I leave my cinnamon to boil in the water for at least five minutes. And I have one nut and egg. I'm just gonna put that in. Allow it to boil as well. I'm just gonna add a little salt to that. Stir that. A few moments later. So I'm going to remove my cover and I'm going to put my stove on low. Then I'm going to add my liquid in. I'm going to cover it and then leave it for 15 to 20 minutes to cook good so you have to keep on whisking it for a little a little while before you cover it okay because you don't want it to be lumpy if it gets too thick, you can always add a little milk. That smells really good. Very nice. So I'm going to remove my cinnamon stick. I'm gonna cover my pot now. So after five minutes, you check on your porridge and whisk again because you don't want no lumpy porridge. So for the 15 or 20 minutes that you put it to cook, every five minutes, you check on it and whisk. Yeah, guys, so your porridge is going to be nice and smooth. You don't want to drink your porridge and you have them lumps in your, you know, taste and have them lumps in your mouth when you're drinking your porridge. You don't want that. Look at that. Very nice. What you're looking for. Yeah. 
Then I cover again. So I'm gonna check on my pot because you don't want any lump into your porridge. So for the 15 to 20 minutes that they're boiling before, I check and whisk again because I don't want any lump in my porridge. And if it's too thick, you can always add a little milk to it. So I'm going to add a little milk. Good. And then you just whisk that out. That's what you're looking for. No lumps. And again, cover. So the porridge is already boiled. So I'm just going to add my vanilla. I'm going to add one teaspoon. I'm going to have a teaspoon. I'm going to add some condensed milk. You can have condensed milk and brown sugar together, but I'm only using condensed milk. I'm just gonna give that a nice mix. So I use that to sweeten uh, my porridge. And you can go along guys and taste and if there's anything else that want to add, you can always add it. Very nice. So that's all you want your porridge to look when you finish boiling it. Look at that. Thank you so much for watching that video. I hope you learned something. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like, share, and let me know in the comment section what you like to see I prepare next. Don't forget to hit that good old notification bell so you'll be one of the first person to be notified when I upload another video. Bye for now.